Day 62, the tensions are running sky high on the set of Love and Thunder because this mood is an all-time low. So I'm about to go and help pick up the spirits with my bubbly, energetic personality. This is 10 years for me. I would have loved every time I played the character. This new film transitions us from endgame into a rebirth. Thor doesn't know what his place is in the universe. <laughs> That's represented in his wardrobe as well. I was really excited to come back as the Mighty Thor and get to share the mantle. What are you wearing? I love it. <laughs> to have both of us in the same cape. <laughs> um, that was amazing and incredible, especially with Taika at the helm. Taika, he's like a big kid. He's like a sort of a genius child. I wasn't afraid to be flamboyant and a bit camp. Hi. Woo! Three, two, one, scream! Giant goats! Look at those! They are wonderful! Yes, they are. They also scream quite a lot. It's hugely imaginative and fun. It's such an enormous scale. It's a crazy space adventure with a new villain who's pretty monstrous. Oh, God, she will die. <laughs> we really raised the bar with Ragnarok. Love and Thunder is even more unique and different, so it's pretty exciting.